Hi everyone, uh, this is Anil. In this video we will uh, talk about how to get uh, a table based on society. So this is a script that uh, takes input as society and then it gives the output as uh, the table which contains a record with that society. So this is a script that I have created. It, be, it starts uh, by querying this table sysdb object to get the list of tables and it makes an array uh, with that information and then I loop through the array to uh, to query each table uh, and that is done in this uh, function where I pass the table name and the society which I want to be queried and then this creates a uh, glide record on the table and then it queries it uh, and then it gives an output uh, which is a JSON format which contains table name and the output uh, which is nothing but the society right so I had to use a try catch block here because uh, and there will be some tables here which you will not have access to in the query even if you run it as admin user and in global scope now uh, to handle those uh, scenarios we have to write a try catch block here and this will return this output JSON which is pushed into this array uh, and then we we do a loop uh, through this array to get the table name and the output value and then we uh, push that to this variable so while doing this we want to ensure that uh, the uh, only the records which actually have an output are pushed so that we don't get every single table but only those table or tables which contain the society and then finally we're printing the this log variable which basically contains the table and the, uh, the output values uh, so we'll run this and we'll see how the output looks like so this is the fixed script and i'm running it uh, it takes about five minutes so we should run it in the background uh, once the script is complete it gives you an output in this format uh, as you can see here it is printing the table names in the society which i'm querying uh, you will observe that it is giving me more than one table output here because uh, uh, this record actually exists in this table uh, but because of the task hierarchy uh, and the, the i mean because of the table hierarchy uh, this is a child table to these two uh, which is why it is showing in these two tables as well uh, so to verify this, uh, I'll go to this uh, list view and I'm uh, querying on this table with the society and you can see that this belongs to this, uh, I mean this is the record uh, which contains the society. So this is how you can uh, identify like which table contains society uh, if you don't know like uh, right away you know what is a table that has a society right so you can use this script uh, you pass the society as input and then it, it gives the table name as output uh, thank you for watching